Mango juice. Yeah, that's what it is. Mango juice. We love mango juice. Real pure too. Look at that. Nice and thick. Mm. Mm. Hey, look, somebody uh, poor baby can't get up there. My dog. She's uh she's running around here, not moving around here. Got her on a leash. Anyway, back to the point. So, um, you know, you don't know, but one of my favorite YouTubers, if you will, is uh, is Black Fuhrer. You know, the Fuhrer. Um, uh, anyway, the, he's over there at the, the Bunker TV. And anyway, he's, he's been laying low, but he's back in town. He sent me a little message or whatever. But in looking at his message, right, I found this other thing for, from a, a, a post. A post I did about the CBC conspiracy posting I did. Anyway, so somebody named Sleepy CCS. I don't like to call Anyway, Sleepy CCS. Sounds like a woman, though. You know what I'm saying? Sleepy CCS. I don't know. This is better. Okay, so here we go. Uh, it's, she's, I think, what is it? She, wait, no, it's, maybe it's a he. No, it's a dude. Hmm. I think it's a dude. I can't see that. Let me see. Hold on a second. I got to go. Sorry. I got to be certain of this. Oh, it looks like a, it's a sister. Okay, I was right, it's a sister. So she wrote, could you do a show, I don't, I don't do show, but I guess she just, I don't know if she's really talking to me. Do a show on the use of, of um, here we go, she's using it in, in, in quotes, of trick bag terms like people of color, minority, and African American. None of those terms spe uh, specify American ADOS. Okay, here's the thing about words and stuff like that, or, or um, those, look, any term, uh, let me put it this way, African-American, like uh, um, uh, Loretta Dumas, Henry Dumas' widow once told me, she said, Anthony, you're, you're, you're the first person I know that used African-American without the hyphen, because we had this thing of hyphens, Afro-American, a bunch of other things, alliterations we went through, but the thing is, because we've always been searching for, uh, for an identity, <laughs> so the thing is, if, if people of color, it doesn't work for, which it never worked for, I never used that term. Then don't use it. <laughs> if, the, if if you're ADS, do not. You, that's that's one of the things we got to have codes. We got to have you know ways of working. And one of the things is we should never use terms that don't apply to us. You know we, we don't want to use. You know, like that. Like that. Now she she's pulling on my my travel bag that I'm traveling with. Hey, Wendy, stop. Okay. Come on. Anyway, uh, so so um. Uh, so words are, 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 are what they are, you know what I mean? And and, and it, it, it's the intent, you know what I mean? That's the intent. But don't use words that don't. That's the, that's the long and the short of it, you know? Um, the other thing is that, you know, it's, what I wanted to say, look, you can make up your own words. Look, I got this dictionary, I don't just a prop, right? I did, I did a, a, a one, one time I was looking, I think it was, we were doing the debt, right? I was looking at the word debt, right? I purposely used this, this dictionary. Right, a big dictionary because you know, you see, with a dictionary, you got like what this is six columns. You know, you, you go to any word here, let's go to this word right here. What's, what's this word here? Um, uh, dimension. Dimension has like, whoa, how many? Six, whatever, six definitions. So, words, you know, with terms, you have a lot of different definitions. I'll leave that on. Um, so, 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 so. so so it's, it's nice, I did that thing purposely because I could have just used a device to look up the word, I think I would look up the word debt. Um, but I use this to show old school, right? And yeah, you could do like this, but if you do it this way, you go directly to the word. Here you have all these other words to meander, and then sometimes you might actually flip the page and then find another word. So it's, it's like if you, okay, that, that's what it is, okay? So you can make up your own words. I'm gonna show you what it means. Ah, and you can make up your own words. All the time, people make up words all the time. Like for instance, that you know, you heard the words like neocon. You know, neo n e o means new, and con for conservative, like neoliberal, ne neolib, whatever those things are. Right? So I made up a term because I don't. Part of Neely, I'm, 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 I'm a follower of Neely, Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. I didn't show you. No, Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. I'm a follower of Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. I'm a denizen. I call it denizen. I'm Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. 
and this is his book. This is the, the, the uh, 1984 edition that I had found here in uh, Allison. You see, that's the book. Anyway, this is the code book. And one of the things he says is don't call people names. Now, man, I said, wow, man. But see, when you say names, names, it offends people. It puts people on things. So if I say, um, if you say uh, nigga or, or um, uh, um, Sambo, you know what I mean? Yeah, Uncle Tom. Well, you shouldn't call people names. But if I'm really going to get mad, I got names to call people, right? Here you go. Instead of Uncle Tom, I'm going to say this first. Word. See, uh, see, here's my two words that I just made up. See how they go? And they're accurate. I think when you make a word, they have to be accurate. I think you complain about people of color or um, African American or, or, or any of these Negro or anything. They're not accurate. They're not precise. When you say it, it could mean a bunch, it could mean six different things. But when you say American descendants of chattel slavery, it could only be one grouping. You see, so it works out for you. you make up your own your own words if you can, and make up your own style. Like here, well, look, look, this death of the ADOS. You know, this thing started. I can't. The, the first look to get to this point. He, he, it's evolution is what I'm trying to say. The, when I first started uh, talking into the camera like this. I've always had my, I have my YouTube channel for a long time, I post stuff up all the time, but uh, 2014 when I first came to Alice, I started to record um, at the bottom of, um, of, the, of the library at the, the, the postgraduate center there, there was a guy there, uh, Brother Belly, and I would talk to him all the time and then I started, but I would take on a character, old man character with a cane, I would take on the character that evolved to that. Then when he retired, you know what I mean? And, uh, and then I moved it into my, my office. That's where you see the one with the Honduran flag with the five stars over my head, whatever have you. And that was a whole other thing. And I was also trying to play it. Was I trying? No, I was more straight. I wasn't doing an old man exactly. But I would have my, 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 um, my ankle braces on, my ankle seat pods, and that kind of thing. Then when I got here, I know, again, I was working, I was doing like that, I had my little space here um, that I built here. Uh, but then ADOS hit, you know, about 2016, when it was. And, um, and then, then I started to do the ADOS signs because that comes out of a thing that I had done because when I was working for Democracy Now!, when Democracy Now! first started, you know it as a TV, whatever, a, a, a cinematic, whatever, program. But when we first started, it was a radio program. When they first put on the cameras, I, can't, I went through the whole story with that. You know, we had just newspapers and stuff all over the wall, you know, so this is the homage to when I was at Democracy Now! Anyway. But also, there's also kinds of things. Like you see, I wear a different hat all the time. This, this is character. I wear these same glasses. I don't. Outside, I, I use I use I, I use the real sun. I want melanin, you know, to it, it enhance myself with with vitamin D and real sun. But inside here, you know, I just this is the whole thing with my eyes. You know, when I was young, so when I was young, when I was very young, um, I would I wouldn't talk. This the legend has that I didn't talk to. I was like three years old, maybe it was six. No, no, three years. I was talking about three. Um, but the interesting thing is that I would just sit and look at people, literally stare at people, and people would, they would, it would go, stop looking at me, stop staring at me. This was a long, this was like six or seven years. I'm going through this from about three years old to like, I don't know, 10, 11, something like that. And it, uh, anyway, so so I got used to not doing that. Speaking about staring and, and, and power of the eyes, power of the, of, the, of, the, of the black look, of the black man's look, the black purpose, the ADOS look. Uh, um, I mentioned the widow, uh, um, Henry Dumas' widow, Loretta, right? Well, Henry Dumas, I'm my favorite writer, he, uh, he wrote a, a short story called, I think it was Fawn, where it is about the eyes. Get that stuff, no, don't worry about it. Anyway, the point is, you have your style to do everything. Now, in all those liberation writers, they had the different characters. So when I got behind his desk and, and I, I built this thing, I didn't, I didn't, well, anyway, what I started to do is I started to use my hands more. So if you actually look at my videos, what you should do, actually, is like when I direct for theater. You know, you could, you should be able to close your eyes and and hear what I'm saying, or, or you know, whatever. But you should also be able to turn the sound down and just look. Now, if you do look, then you'll be treated to something. You'll be treated to a hand dance. I do these. I do a hand dance behind the desk. That's the way it links. There's no. So I do. I do. If you see a lot, I use my hands a lot. Now, when you're using a camera, usually you're not supposed to do that. But I don't listen to those kind of things. I'm just another little race. So I use my hands. You know what I mean? And I like. If in another lifetime, I think I would have been a you know an orchestra conductor because I you know I'm just you know and I never I should have been a hand model. I let a lot of money. My point. My point. The whole thing is is that there are many ways to approach things. 
you take from it what you will. If you don't want something, in other words, you don't like watching my hands, just turn the um, turn the, um, the, the the video video the, the visuals off. You know, if you don't like the way I sound, I'm telling you, the hand dance is a nice thing. I watch it sometimes just to watch the hand dance. I say all that to say, well, I don't know. That's it. You know, so so um, what's the sister's name? So CC CC uh, whatever her name was. Um, uh, thank you for your question. I hope I answered it. I know I probably began it. Uh, Sleepy CCS. Thank you for your question. That's your answer. From me, T, from the Pattersons, taking the train to the pet, letting you know which I only suspect from a desk of the ADOS that would be the American descendants of chattel slavery. 